save time when setting up accounting, you can import your existing customer and supplier details. You can do this by adding the information to a comma-separated value, or CSV, file, which you can then import into accounting. The system uses the information in the file to create all the required contact records. To import contact information, go to the Contacts menu. In this example, we'll import customer information, but the steps are the same to import supplier information, except that instead of going to the Customers page, selecting the drop-down arrow next to New Customer, and selecting Import Customers, you'd go to the Suppliers or Vendors page and select the Import option there. Your customer details must be in a specific format for accounting to correctly set up the customer records. There's a link in the Import Customers dialog box to download a CSV template in the required format. For guidance on which fields are mandatory and the information you need to enter, there's also a link from the Import Customers dialog box to our Help Center. Depending on your browser, the template will either open automatically in Microsoft Excel or be saved to the Downloads folder on your computer from where you can open it. Either type or copy the customer details into the relevant fields in the file and save the file under a recognizable name on your computer. Once you've saved the file, close it before you try import it into accounting. Back in the Import Customer dialog box in accounting, Select Choose File and browse to the folder in which you saved the updated CSV file. Select the file, then select Open. Ensure the CSV format is set to Accounting, then select Upload. When the import completes successfully, a message appears telling you the number of contact records created in Accounting. Select OK to close the Import Customers dialog box and complete the process. If for any reason the import fails, an error message will appear explaining why. Fix the errors, then upload the CSV file again. For further information and in-depth courses, visit Sage University at sageu.com. If you have any questions or need guidance, visit the Sage Support Resource Center at sage.com forward slash resources, where you can ask the community, search the knowledge base, or get in touch with us by chat.